Things to play when you suck. You suck it. You suck it. <laughs> So I spoke to Mr. Yevgeny, or Zap, as you probably know him, and we agreed that doing some occasional easy lessons would probably be a good idea, as uh, most of our users are actually beginners. So when designing this lesson, uh, I asked myself, what should be the criteria for a things to play when you suck lesson? So it struck me that all the licks gotta be played with your bad mother finger, you know, the bad mother finger. Uh, if you can play a lick with your, only with your bad mother finger, then it's got to be a real sucky lick. So imagine the following kind of scenario. You're a regular kind of beginner guy. You got this guitar, you got a pick, you got a bad mother finger, and uh, yeah, you want to impress some girls. I want to impress many, 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 many women. So, what do you do? Well, you grab your pick and your bad mother finger and you play first cap. That's gonna give you some serious chicks and it's not that hard. So, what I'm doing there is first a slide. This kind of slide. I wouldn't recommend fretting the normal kind of way with the, you know, the curved finger like that, the curved bad mother finger. Instead, I want you to flat the bad mother finger uh, so that you're actually fretting at least two strings. The more, the better. Uh, but two strings will be enough. So if you, if you have your your uh, bad mother finger the flat way, you're actually actually going to be playing fourths. So we're going to be sliding up with fourths. And, by the way, I'm tuned down a half step. So, from the second fret... Once again, if you have your finger curved, you're not going to be covering two strings and it's not going to sound as heavy. And you're not going to get as many cheeks! So, listen to my words of wisdom. I am going to get some woman! Okay. So, um... Number two is to play a power chord with your bad mother finger. Now this time we're going to have an open low E string and we're going to play an E5 chord by fretting the A and the D string on the second fret with our bad mother finger once again. This isn't, you know, kind of recommended kind of fingering for these chords, but if you're new to this, we're making it easy for you. Yeah, now, for striking the three lowest strings, we're going to be do, uh, striking with a damped pick strike. So, down with the palm, hit the three strings, and then do the same thing, but with the palm up in the air. So we get, once again, damped, Open. Now let's combine this with our slide and see how the chicks gather. I see the woman coming out of me. Now everybody knows that in order to get some chicks, we gotta play some licks too. Uh, and I've designed this specific lick for you to play it only with your bad mother finger once again. Uh, it's gonna be this kind of a hammer-ons and pull-off lick, or a trill lick. So, with our bad mother finger, we hit the fifth fret, which produces an A note, and then we're gonna pull off with a downward motion, and that's gonna produce an E note, the, the open E string, just as if you were picking the string. So, hammer-on very hard, no picking here, and then pull off to the E string. Okay? Don't start using your pick there, because you're not going to get quite as easily up to the higher tempos. 
So, uh, with that kind of thing, we can then add our Wummy Bar, which is a real chick magnet, by the way. Um, and we're gonna be doing the exact same motion over and over again. It doesn't matter if you're a bit sloppy here, just you know, do the motion and use... Use the Wummy Bar, okay? That's pretty cool, but still not as quite as cool as what I'm about to show you. Let me put it like this. If you haven't got a Wummy Bar, consider yourself lucky. Because what I'm going to show you now is going to be an even better chick magnet. So, uh, instead of using the Wummy Bar, we're going to place our right hand here, and we're going to grab the string um, past the, the nut, I think it's called. We're going to grab the E string Whoa! Not bad! And I mean, you know, let's face it Which girl is going to be impressed by this? I don't think it's going to cut it You break! You break! You insult me! I okay. want my woman! I want my woman! Now! I've prepared a little more difficult sucky exercise for you, or a sucky lick. And this one is not only going to be using a bad mother finger, it's going to be using two! Check this out. On a more seri serious note, uh, this kind of thing is very cool to build up speed with. Um, I'm not doing this very fast now. Still, you'll notice that I'm actually doubling the tempo when adding to, to uh, another bad on the finger. So, these kind of things allow for extremely fast playing. If you're only in the game for the speed, do this. Whoa! I'm gonna be practicing this for a while and then I'm gonna try to play it as fast as I can. Whoa, it's amazing! Um, either way, what I'm doing is the exact same thing as the previous licks, lick, but uh, I'm adding the, the right hand as well. So I'm alternating. Which is yet the reason why I don't want you to use the pick in there. Okay, now once you got that down, you can start moving it around. And now I'm just going from the fifth fret to the seventh fret to the eighth fret, and then back again. Seven, five, five, seven, eight, seven, five. Okay, now but you can do all sorts of chromatic stuff with it. Whatever you want. Okay, now that's it. So I hope uh, with all this information you're gonna suck like never before. And if you don't, then keep practicing these sucky licks. See you soon. Cheers. I am going to town. With my guitar, with my pick, and with my bad butter finger. And I'm going to search for many, 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 many women. Woman! Woman!